but trying to find a home to raise four children in a good environment and still have money left over to feed the children is still a huge challenge. In Duluth, our rental market is very tight and over 65% of our renters pay more than 30% of their income in housing. That's really unacceptable. Our housing needs updating, needs renovation and revitalization, and we really need more options. I gotta worry about wanting the next meal, paying other bills. I have, um, I'm supposed to be paying off student loan. I can't pay them off. There is 150,000 square feet in this building. 100,000 square feet of that space will be converted um, to uh, apartment homes. Um, this classroom as well will be someone's home eventually. Um, 50 apartments will be built in this building. Seven of those will be for homeless individuals and we'll be working with the Salvation Army along with that. We can have for a car payment and a rental place at the same time. And it's been a pattern. Either we have a car or we're homeless, or we have a house or we don't have a car. I have to get up to pay for a cab ride to get them to school or take a bus. If we take a bus, we're up at 5.30 in the morning getting ready and catch a bus at 6.30. So I mean, these are some of the challenges that we have to do, and I'm sure a lot of families have to do it. And it's just hard.